call it Stormy Monday. A great old blues song. Hi, I'm Red, and uh, I'm here to help you take a look at Stormy Monday. We'll look at both lead and rhythm. I'm going to run through the track one time and play some rhythm stuff, and then I'll roll through once and play some lead stuff. Then I'll stop and talk about what I did. Now we're in the key of G, and what's very cool about this song is it follows a standard 1-4-5 blues pattern, but it incorporates a chord change that spices it up and makes you think a little bit when you're soloing. And, and, and for that matter, when you're playing rhythm too. So here we go. I'm going to zoom the camera in so you get a little better look at my fretboard. There we go. And Stormy Monday. I'm going to start with a G9 chord. C9. Back to a G9. I'm doing the sliding sixth. Sliding sixth on the C as well. G7, A minor 7, B minor 7, B flat 7, D9, D sharp 9, D9, back to a G, C, G, and then D augmented. Now a quick rundown of what I was doing there. Over the G chord, I'm playing either a G9 or a G7. Over the G9, I can do a sliding sixth. And with the G7, I can do this little hammer, or, or I guess a roll, finger roll with a minor third hammered. Basically, I'm a G7. That's a C major triad on the second, third, and fourth string. Then G minor triad, second, third, and fourth string. And then hammer to the major third on the third string. That move sounds like this. Notice I was hybrid picking. I'm using the pick and a few fingers. It goes back to the C9. You can do sliding six there. Then on the walk up, we've got a G, then an A minor. I'm using an A minor seven, and I'm doing a little hammer on the third string. B minor, same hammer, a B flat 7, then a D9, D sharp 9, D9, back to the G, C, G, and then a D augmented, and I'm going to show you that move, because it's a very cool blues move. I'm going to... Um, Basically, I'm arpeggiating the D augmented, and then I'm adding the E note on the second string at the fifth fret, and the G note 
on the first string at the third fret. And here's that move. I'm going to play it slowly for you so you can pick it up. And here's what it sounds like at full tempo. Okay, now as far as the lead goes, I'm playing G minor pentatonic, G major pentatonic, and I'm mixing them together. And I'm trying to follow the change f over the minor chords. So I'm playing right up in here. That's the BB King box. I can also play those same notes right over here. Then I'm also playing G ma minor pentatonic. I'm extending that on the second and third string, or sec first and second string. That allows me to connect, it kind of connects me right to the, between the ma minor and major pentatonic. Okay, the last thing I'm going to give you is that little lick I used um, in the minor pentatonic there. Slowed down. And one more time at speed. All right, I hope that helps give you some insight to the song and hopefully gives you some new spice to throw into Stormy Monday.